me welcome back in our new uh, tutorial. Um, remember from another previous uh, tutorial about the closing, you can wear your Adidas, yeah, or you have the pants. Okay, and now we are doing today the parkour hole. It's very important the parkour hole. Uh, when you're standing, for example, on the wall or on the other high uh, building, uh, let's say twice your length of the body, yeah, and you have to jump down, you can use the parkour wall. So the parkour wall, how does the parkour wall work? Just like that. Very simple, but there are some rules. You can use your hands like that, diamond. When you're going to roll over your right shoulder, place your hands to the left. Make sure that your right shoulder is first touching the ground. Roll over, coming with your right foot in front of you, your right foot up. And you can walk on. The line on the floor is from the right shoulder to the left. That line is a straight line over the floor. A straight line. One more time. You're standing, you're landing on the bow of your feet, and you go forward like that. Roll over, coming up, and you can move on. Yeah? What you also can do is you place your hands in that way. I prefer this way. You're using your hands like that, touching the ground with your shoulder. And if you move, if you watch the, the back, yeah? if you watch the back, you go from here to here. Like that. Yeah. So what you don't have to do is the head roll like that. Place two hands here and that. And yeah, you're hurting, hurting your head and your neck. That's, not. That's why we have to place your hands to the right, to the left. If you place your right shoulder first, or when you're left-handed, you can also go to the right and place your left shoulder here and the left shoulder to the right. That's fine. Yeah. I'm going to try it. So, first this one. And now you're coming with your left foot first and coming up. Yeah, it's up to you. That's the parkour hole. 